but we didn't do any kind of hiking or any waterfalls. But we did visit the school that was right there, so that was perfect. And but before that, uh, the beginning of the journey was perfect. Uh, we went to the Maasai Arts and Craft Center, and also um, once we left from there, we went to the uh, Arusha Decoration Museum. So I was able to get a good introduction from the tour guide for like 20 minutes. Then I was able to go around and do my own documentation for about 23 minutes, so that was good video. Then we went to the Boma Museum. I was able to get about seven good videos. It was so much documentation. That was probably one of the better ones. The only issue about the museum is the upkeep and the maintenance. Um, if, when I look on the outside, it doesn't, really, it doesn't really excite you about inside. But once you get inside, you, you're done. You, you're good. But so, you know, but with tourist sites, tourist sites have to be preserved. And I understand that if we don't have a lot of people coming to the tourist site, then there's not enough money to maintain the buildings. So, um, but also what I noticed, we were the only ones in the museums, both of them, nobody else, not one other person. So, I don't know if those museums are visited a lot. But what I, one thing I do know is, when I was on YouTube, when I was online, trying to see other people who went to the museums, Ouch. I couldn't find any videos. 